Words are the cosmic sound that permeates all life and matter. They are the vibration that animates and forms everything in the universe, from the smallest particles to the largest celestial bodies. The universe itself is an illusion created by the eternal spirit to manifest and experiment with its diversity, to bring forth the world of matter. This spirit brought forth a cosmic sound, and the difference between energy and matter is determined by the rate of vibration. As the cosmic sound of the divine rises to a high pitch, energy is transmuted into spirit. Conversely, as the sound descends to a low pitch, energy takes on the form of matter. Matter is made of energy and vibration, a fact that physicists have come to know through experiments and research. However, the saints, prophets, sages, and yogis of ancient times knew this long before modern science. They understood that all matter manifested through cosmic sound, also known as the word. When the universal force sings the song of creation, it causes energy to vibrate and dance in harmony with its rhythm. This cosmic melody creates sacred geometric patterns, which in turn give shape to matter. As a result, all matter manifests itself through its cosmic sound. And without this sound, nothing can be done. Without this sound, matter cannot exist. When we think of sound, we often think of something we hear with our ears. But sound is much more than that. Sound is a vibration, a movement of energy through space. Just as cats can pick up frequencies beyond our auditory range, the world is teeming with vibrations and frequencies undetectable to our senses, yet they persistently oscillate around us, shaping our environment in ways beyond our perception. These subtle energies that lie beyond our visual or auditory capacities are omnipresent. Sound, fundamentally, a vibrational force, possesses the ability to materialize physical forms when its resonance reaches a certain potency. Our world is populated with sounds. From the external ones, we easily perceive to the internal sounds of our own bodies. In ancient times, immersed in deep states of meditation, Yogis understood that there was much more to sound than meets the eye. In the stillness of their practice, they mentally repeated specific sounds, called mantras, or syllables, linked to particular forms of energy. When, through repetition and the power of their concentration, their consciousness dissolved into the mantra, a particular form appeared in their vision. Each mantra was linked to a distinct form, known as a yantra, which can be defined as an archetypal form. The yogis comprehended and experienced that the universe was composed of sound, or in other words, vibrations. The primordial sound that initiated everything is Om, also known in Christianity as Amen. This is why the Bible says that all things were made through the word also known as the Amen, which is the first sound produced by God to manifest the universe. All things are done through the word because the word is the cosmic vibration that animates and forms all matter. The Amen is the origin of all sounds and languages, and those who have perfectly tuned their vibration with the Amen can understand all languages, including those of men, animals, and atoms. The Amen is the mother of all things, giving birth to matter by the power of the E.M. This cosmic vibration is inaudible to the human ear, but can be heard internally by the ear of intuition. The power of words extends beyond the creation and sustaining of physical matter. Letters and words are channelers of intelligent energy, such as thought and emotion that allow us to communicate with each other. Each letter of a word has the power to contain intelligent energy within a geometric form. And when these letters and words are spoken, they carry this energy out into the world. It is through the creative power of words that we can transform energy into matter.
bringing our thoughts and ideas to life. Our words can shape our reality and the reality of those around us as we speak and write, co-creating the world with the universal force that guides us. Words are mere vessels carrying within them the power of thought and the energy of creation. To unlock the true potential of words, we must delve deeper into their meaning and understand their true essence. Words also hold great knowledge and can connect us to the mysteries of the universe. They are symbols that represent thoughts and ideas, and they hold immense power in the realm of human consciousness. The true meaning of a word is not simply its dictionary definition, but the vibrations and frequencies it carries when we speak or think it, when we speak or think a word. We are tapping into the energetic realm of creation and manifestation. The word I holds a special significance, for it refers not only to the self, but to our connection with the source. As fragments of the source, we are one with it, yet we retain our own unique path and reality. To say I am is to tap into the pure state of consciousness, the very essence of existence itself. We become creators, generators of our own reality, manifesting our deepest desires through the quantum void of being. The phrase I am holds a great deal of significance in the human language, as it serves as a powerful declaration of existence and identity. Its creative power is immense, for when we affirm our presence in the world and declare our individuality with the words I am, we assert our unique place in the universe. However, the impact of I am extends beyond just individuality. It also represents a declaration of unity with the source of all creation. When we say, I am, we are tapping into this universal energy, aligning ourselves with its creative power and acknowledging our place in the grand scheme of things. But words alone are not enough. We must also understand the vibration and frequency they carry, ensuring that our thoughts align with our intentions. Deeply held beliefs shape our reality, and it is only by becoming aware of the true meaning behind our words that we can manifest our true potential. The words we speak have the power to shape our thoughts, our emotions, and ultimately our lives. They can inspire us to greatness or hold us back in fear and doubt. To truly harness the power of words, we must understand their deeper meanings and use them intentionally. When we speak or think a word, we are generating a thought form that can shape our reality. If we use words that align with our highest aspirations and beliefs, we can manifest a life that reflects our truest desires. When we use affirmations like I am abundance, I am love, or I am joy, we are declaring our intention to manifest these qualities in our lives. But we must do so with full awareness and understanding of the power of our words. We must feel the vibration of these words in our hearts and minds, and we must align ourselves with their energetic frequency. The true magicians, the creators of conscious reality, are those who understand the power of words and the essence of being. They do not simply repeat affirmations, but comprehend the profound meaning behind them and harness their power to create their own reality. In many cultures, people believe in the power of incantations, spells and affirmations to bring about change. The use of mantras and chants and meditation is also an example of the power of words to influence the mind and bring about a state of inner peace. In addition to their creative power, words can also have a destructive impact. Negative words can harm relationships damage, self-esteem, and even lead to violence and discrimination. On the other hand, positive words can have a healing effect, building self-confidence and strengthening relationships. The power of words is not limited to their impact on personal stories. 
They can also influence the course of history. Speeches and writings by political leaders, activists, and philosophers have inspired social movements and brought about change in societies. Ultimately, everything that we see, hear, touch, taste, and feel is a manifestation of our consciousness. For without consciousness, there would be no perception of reality. The cosmic sound that permeates all existence is the very fabric of our reality. And by understanding and harnessing the power of words, we can unlock the secrets of the universe and become the creators of our own destiny.